Alright, this is column number two. We are going to take our main shaft here off of the head system and we're going to check it to see if this thing is straight. Alright, so all we got to do is take this bolt right here out. Uh, where are we at? There we are. All we got to do is take this bolt right here out and we got to take this little thing off right here. So we're going to go ahead and unscrew those. And there's a nut on the back of the one. So we'll have to hold that with our needle nose pliers. So once you get that little nut off, then you can just take the little screw and just slide that guy right out of there. If it's being tricky on you, like mine, you can just use your needle nose pliers to pull that out. <clears throat> okay. And now that's the main head separated from the main shaft. Right. Now we're going to set that down very carefully. We don't want to break it. Of course, I have to take this guy off first. Uh, always note the position that it sits. Okay, anyway, <clears throat> so I'm just taking those guys off there. And then once I get that loose, I can slide it off. So we're going to note that this part is on the bottom side in comparison to the top of the shaft where the nut is, or the hole. Alright, so let me just slide take that guy Take it and roll it across our table and see if it wobbles. Now, I'm doing it at various speeds here and I don't see any wobble. I'm not sure how that looks on camera, but in here it looks really smooth. So, our main shaft is straight and does not need changing, although you could do it at this point. Okay, I'm just going to put this camera down here for now. Alright, so now we're just going to put everything back together. We're going to note our top and our bottom and put this on with that facing the bottom and slide it back up into position and once we have that back in position we're going to go ahead and lock it down okay I'm going to make sure those are good and tight we don't want them coming off and then reassemble our head unit. We're just going to slip the main shaft onto the head through all those little parts. Uh, we're going to note that we're going to line up the hole. Okay, see there? Make sure I line up the hole correctly. You can see how I'm turning it and it's shutting the hole on and off basically. And then we're going to just put the screw right back through it again. And then tighten her on down. Okay, so there's the screw through it. And now we're just going to attach the nut, which is easiest done if we hold it in the needle nose pliers up against the little thing here. And then we just twist it on. <clears throat> 